Hey, I'm Todd with Forge Fire and Company. I wanna go over a quick tip on how to make your training more efficient, more effective with dirty drags. Oftentimes we see it where we tend to train dirty drags with other firefighters wearing full turnout gear. That's a bad habit we don't wanna do unless we absolutely have to with the environment of limiting injuries. But for the most part, we actually wanna have our victims our, uh, that we're using for training wearing uh, little to no clothing so we don't have to re rely on the clothing. You can see here he doesn't have a jacket or any any kind of clothing on for his wrists and arms. Again, we don't want to rely on if they have a turnout gear or pants. Grabbing the pants, we want to use big muscle movement like grabbing their full ankles, crossing, grabbing their legs to affect our dirty drags. Again, limit the amount of clothing your victims have, your training uh, partners, and then use big muscle movements, not relying on clothing or turnout gear.